I guess the second point is one that you just brought up, Jim, and that is it's interesting that I've had a plaintiff's bar guy intimate that the, a common process is you get a bacterial infection, and that then what kills you is the viral super infection. Oh, my gosh. And I said, that is ridiculous. It's, it's usually almost always bacterial with a, I mean, a viral with bacterial super infection in every patient of every age. Right. So I just wanted you to comment on that. Yeah, and I would, I would agree. Now, certainly viral infections can kill you. RSV is a known killer. Sure. What the literature says is about 1% of babies that get RSV die from it. I think that's an overestimate. We, we see lots and lots and lots of kids with RSV in our hospital, in our ED, and I don't think anywhere close to 1% are dying from it. But of those that are admitted, 1%, that's a, that's a, that's a number that I might believe. Um, so you can die from respiratory infections. You can get sepsis from respiratory infections. Remember, sepsis is not a term that is unique to bacterial infections. But as a general principle, um, the, the, the more common scenario is that you go from having a viral infection, again, a, some kind of a breach in the defenses, and then you get a bacterial superinfection on top of it. And the classic is pneumonia. You get a viral pneumonia, you get a, you get a, you get a cold. I mean, uh, one, one of the... One of the uh, uh, principles that I, I try to get you guys to, to hear uh, frequently is this idea that we need to get a chest x-ray on somebody with a cough and a runny nose after two days of symptoms. Generally speaking, pneumonia is a complication from a cold or a flu that happens several days into it. A normal healthy kid doesn't go from being healthy one day to having pneumonia the next day unless you get an aspiration or something something like this. But as a general rule of thumb, it's, it's I get the flu on Monday, the flu's really horrible from Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I'm starting to get a little bit better. Then on Friday, things start to turn the other way again. That's when the bacterial superinfection is kicking in. Yes. 